me, I want what's coming to me. Oh, well, what's coming to you, Tony? The world, Chico. And everything in it.
What happens when the world is yours, and then you lose it? Just remember.
What you fucking looking at? Fucking balls! Fucking cocksucker! Don't fuck with me! What the fuck? No fucking way! Eat shit! You fucking Colombian fuck! Fucking maricon! Mr. Montana? Jesus Christ, I thought you were dead. You writing a fucking book or what? No, no, I... I just... Do you know how hard it's been to get any good coke around here? Is that Hossa Sheffield in the club? Yeah, he in here. There's a couple of guys from Vice in here, too. Watch your back, Tony. Thanks, man. If you want any free legal advice, how about a little head? Seriously. We need to talk, George. What do you want? Tony? I want Sosa's head on a fucking platter, man. Sosa, Tony? Impossible. Why? You got some kind of shortage of platters? Tony, come on. Where the hell you been? What happened? War. That's what. 
Sosa probably think I'm dead or run off or something. Well, I'm back, okay? This is my town, my world, George, and nobody's gonna take it away from me. I come to talk to you first because you know what's going on. You still work for me, George, huh? You still my lawyer? Tony, babe, you know the score. Uh, it's gonna be dangerous to be associated with you right now. Word's gonna spread that you're back in town. Can't do it. Spread the word, Chef. Come on, look at me. I know Miami. I'm gonna take it all back. You know it's true. So surprised taking all those other guys for a big ride. Caspar Gomez, Nacho Contreras, the Diaz brothers. They're all fucking worms. Hey, you want me? It's gonna cost you, Tony. And more than before. None of that chicken feed, either. Where's the loyalty, George, you fucking snake? I know you got connections. You just gotta make it happen. You took my money before, and that makes you just as bad as me. But I'm alive, George. I'm alive. And now what you gonna do, huh? You still work for me. All right, Tony. You wanna get something going? A friend of mine runs the bar in Coconut Grove. Talk to her. And Tony? I, uh, I don't work for free. Coco? So you know. Never heard of her. Got to talk to Felix. By now what he knows. Careful, my man! Oh, look at you. You dance like a rat crawled in your pants, man. And what's your problem, Chico? What's all over your face, pal? Your wife's pussy. Well, little man, I'd be real careful walking around town with that stuff. Yeah, you never know who you might run into. Hey, who'd you call in little man? I kicked your ass all over the dance floor, okay? Okay, Tony, no more bullshit. You know how this works. We've got your mansion locked up tighter than a nun's ass, and if you want it back, you're gonna have to cough up the cash. Oh, you got... Fuck that. I gotta talk to Felix, see what he knows. I knew way.
you left. Sosa's trying to run me out. He's putting the squeeze on all the small-time suppliers. Surprise! All that gonna change. The others are pissed. Nacho Contreras and the Diaz brothers lost out. They heard about Sosa working with Gaspar. It's a war, Tony. They're all trying to take over what you had. Tell me what you know, man. I was at your storehouse two months ago, you know. I didn't know what was going on. Word on the street was that you were dead, so I had to look around. When I got there, I recognized a couple of your guys, but then I saw Gaspar. He was inside watching over the loading of the delivery truck. I bought a couple of keys off them, but the price was jacked. It's been tough since you left, Tony. There are only a few independent dealers you can trust anymore. That's all gonna change. Do you work for me? We take this town by the balls. I'm with you, Tony, if you need me, man. I need to start making my own moves. Gotta get back in, you know? Gonna have to pay off the vice to get my mansion back, fuckers. From there, we can rebuild the business. Take what I've got to get you started. Talk to... Tony, it's good to have you back, man.
You selling candy canes? What you got for me, man? You're lucky I need that candy, cabron.
The government not paying you clowns enough? Hey, buddy, we're vice. Not some loose-knit government agency looking for handouts. You know how this is gonna work from here on out, don't you? Fuck you. Mel Bernstein tried this shit on me once, and it didn't work out so good for him, you know. Mel? He wasn't a team player, Montana. You did us all a favor. Look, Montana, Miami is our backyard. The people pay us to make sure scumbags like you keep the economy nice and stable. We don't want to get in the way unless you force us to, understand? Our boys in the street keep tabs on you. You start doing too many things that upset the people, then your heat goes up. If your heat gets too high, then we'll be forced to make a house call. So, if you want to keep it cool with us, Montana, we suggest you make a donation. Maybe you two should go home and donate a little something to your wives, you know? Relax a little. <laughs> Watching you, boy. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>